We're live right here to end out this opening hour on a Thursday on the early line on Sports Grid. He is Donnie Wright's side. I am Ben Stevens. Another night, another record for Iowa's Caitlin Clark. A 33-point triple-double last night to lead Iowa to a victory over Minnesota in Minneapolis. 108-60. 108-60. Iowa covers as a 19-and-a-half-point road favorite. A total of 159-and-a-half does go over Clark who had 33 points 12 assists and 10 rebounds her 17th career triple double is now officially the all-time scoring leader at the major level in women's college basketball you might be saying yeah she passed Kelsey Plum about a week and a half ago which is true but in the pre-NCAA era the AIAW Kansas's Lynette Woodard actually scored the most points ever with 3,649. Clark needed 33 last night. She got 33 to pass Woodard and now has 3,650 in her college basketball career. I mean, my goodness, a 60 point effort out of the Minnesota Golden Gophers here, getting beat down 108 to 60. Certainly pretty impressive. But as we get ready for March Madness, dare I say this? The conference tournament's been. Is the Big Ten going to put more resources here in the women's Big Ten tournament than the men's? Maybe, you know, it will get to go viral. The women's workout area and locker rooms way better than the men's here because it looks like the women might be the draw this year. They certainly are the draw. They have sold out all seven sessions already in Minneapolis for the Big Ten women's tournament, which begins next week. That is because of Caitlin Clark. And how about a chance for Caitlin Clark, who is now just 18 points away from setting the Division I scoring record, moving past Pistol Pete Maravich on Sunday. It's going to be a top-five tilt between Iowa and number 2 Ohio State in Carver-Hawkeye. The Buckeyes beat the Hawkeyes back in Columbus in late January. Iowa gets a chance for revenge, and more history for Clark on Sunday is coming. 